Hi guys, happy Friday. Me and hubby just dropped off the last of our Christmas items in storage and it's gonna be like a relaxing day but I definitely do have a haul coming at you today. Hi friends, me and hubby here. We just dropped off all the Christmas stuff. Let me tell you, it was a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of stuff in our storage facility where we keep all the holiday goodies. And yes, I was mentioning that there is going to be a haul. I'm gonna share with you a few items that I totally missed out that I forgot to grab when I did my haul video um, from Goodwill. And then also I'm going to be showcasing the Ray Dunn finds that I found discounted for the after Christmas sale. So yeah, it's kind of a very chill day. Tomorrow is Saturday. And as you all know, we're going to Disneyland and I'm so excited. And it was all because of my hubby who gifted me that for Christmas. So I'm celebrating the parks um, early for my birthday and I couldn't be any more excited. So it's kind of a very chill day, getting a lot of chores done. And of course I have to plan my outfit, what I'm gonna wear tomorrow. Cause hello, I'm gonna be vlogging everything. So I'm very, very excited. So we're driving back home and this is Anaheim Hills, the ritzy side of Anaheim. And it's such a beautiful drive going back home. I absolutely love it. It feels like if you're almost like in a different area, different city, different like whole state, like country-ish, I wanna say, almost like farm style kind of, almost like cabin-ish in a way if that makes any sense at all. But I just absolutely love the drive going back home. Hi friends, before we jump into the fun part of this video, I wanted to go ahead and do a shout out to my friend Casa Verali. If you are not following her channel, she is such such a lovely person. She is such a sweetheart and she is such a good friend and her channel is full of amazing videos and decorate with me. You guys she is amazing. She creates some of the most beautifulest displays I've ever seen. I absolutely enjoy her content. I love all her Christmas decor that she did for December and now she's jumping into a winter look. If you guys are not following my friend Casa Verali, make sure to head on over to her channel. I will link her channel below in the description and let her know that Daniel sent you over. Show her some love, subscribe to her channel, check her videos out, make sure that you love them and give some comments. Again, her videos are amazing and she does such beautiful displays. I absolutely love it. And she gives so, so much thought and you know, just like perfection into these designs and displays throughout her home that I'm like, oh my gosh, this is seriously such a great inspiration. So definitely head on over to her channel and show her some love. Hey guys, welcome to the haul portion of this video. So I'm so excited to share with you guys a few items that I have. A lot of them are um, things that I forgot to get when I showed you my Goodwill uh, Christmas haul and other stuff that I found at Goodwill with the Ray Dunn stuff. Um, I don't know why I just forgot, but I have a few items that I still wanted to show you guys on this video, as well as all the other Ray Dunn items that I found at TJ Maxx, Marshalls, um, like the Christmas after sale. And I have a little special treat for you guys. So make sure to stay until the end of this video to find out what that is. So without further ado, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I would love and appreciate for you to hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you are notified of all my weekly videos. And you're more than welcome to follow me on Instagram. And you can find me under second underscore chance underscore love underscore. So I hope that this video finds you all well, guys. Again, today is just a very chill day. Tomorrow, Disneyland is in the plans, you know, so we are just relaxing. I'm getting ready. I need to figure out an outfit because I want to look cute. Hello. I want to look cute for the parks. I'm just so excited, you guys. I am so thrilled to be going back to Disneyland after so long of being an annual pass holder. I just, you know, I did give up my pass and I haven't gone for maybe like two or three years, I want to say. But I'm just so excited that we get to enjoy that and I get to enjoy that with my hubby. I'm just going to grab whatever in no particular order. And the first thing that I have here is a TJ Maxx find. And this was a Christmas clearance item. I was so happy because I really, really wanted one of these when I saw it. But I just couldn't find it in myself to pay full price for it. And I am so excited because I'm going to get to use it for next year. 
and it's giving me vintage vibes yes it's the north pole radio by mr christmas and it says follow the magic it's absolutely so stunning guys this is so so vintage inspired it's like a vintage radio it says north pole radio the dial face is so cute with santa and the reindeer so it's giving off very very vintage feels this was ten dollars on clearance it's absolutely so adorable and let me turn it on right now really quick it's so cute it's absolutely adorable it has a bunch of dials that you can change the station to as well this is your north pole weatherman blizzard bob reporting live from the front steps of santa's workshop i think it's just so absolutely adorable because it totally reminds me of um the little mini radio that i had so this is tune in for the latest christmas weather news and music plays nine songs and it runs on three double a batteries so for ten dollars i definitely scored this and i was so happy it's just so cute and i absolutely love it another christmas item that i found actually at that same tj maxx was this set of three ray dunn mini pillows and they say fa la la so this was really really cute and this was only ten dollars it was originally 19.99 so it was half price and here's a picture of them so you guys can see how they look fa la la so these are absolutely perfect i can't wait to put these out on my living room and my couch they're gonna be absolutely so adorable and i'm so happy that i got them for 10 dollars that is such a score for these and i don't know about what about what you guys do but you guys see this little ribbon wrapping that's holding the pillows that says ray done i keep this let me know in the comments below if you guys keep it and use it as a cute decor piece because i have seen some people do that and they keep it to like decorate their canisters and stuff like that and i think that's so cute keeping with ray ray done with ray ray done keeping with ray done i have another ray done item guys i got this for ten dollars at tj maxx it is a christmas item and it says merry christmas this thing is very long and it's basically a wooden sign that you can hang over on your wall i just think this is absolutely perfect i cannot wait it's red and the it's die the letters are like die cut into the material and it says merry christmas and the background is white on the lettering so i just thought this was absolutely so cute and i cannot wait to display this um maybe in my kitchen area more likely in my living room is where i'm gonna have it because i have an area right now that i know that i would want to hang something there next year and moving on to another goodwill item these are one of the items that I forgot to share with you guys. This thing is huge. I had to haul it out of the garage because, ooh, I just gave myself a cardboard cut. Oh, I don't think I'm bleeding. No, it just cut the skin. Haha, <laughs> I'm okay. So this thing is huge, you guys. I brought it from the garage and it's actually going to be going to storage as you guys saw i went to the storage with my hubby today and we put all of our christmas stuff away everything is gone that's christmas at our house and this you guys it's a huge christmas wreath look i can kind of give you an idea it's humongous so this is a goodwill find and it comes it's brand new and it has like a bell in the middle in the middle it's absolutely gorgeous this is originally from target it's a threshold brand and it's from studio mcgee that it was crafted and it's an extra large spruce with bell indoor decorative use only originally from target and it's from 2021 so this is from last year and it's brand new i got this at goodwill for 15 dollars it was originally 30 dollars but because goodwill was doing a 50 percent off on christmas i got it for half price so you just can't beat that this thing is huge and for 15 bucks it looks very realistic and i love that that it looks almost real lifelike and i just i couldn't believe it the price the price itself is what made me like just jump on it because hello 15 dollars for that huge wreath yes that's an amazing score i mean don't you agree 
moving on to the next item guys i have another ray dunn find and this is a throw um it's very pretty again it has that bow that i keep this this little wrapping right here for decorative reasonings so it's a buffalo check sherpa throw 50 inch by 60. it was 13 dollars, and it's christmas theme it says tis the season and it has a little christmas tree you can kind of see it right there this was 13 dollars, and i think it was originally 20 something i can't see the original tag but i just think it's absolutely gorgeous and it's gonna look so perfect for like on my couch or something like that next year when i'll get to display it onto the couch so it can be an easy way to get something comfortable and warm these are by enchante accessories and ray dunn so i thought these were you know this was such a cool cool find and i love it it's so perfect and it's gonna look so cute next year at my couch in the living room Ooh, i just dropped something but don't worry it did not break and let's see what we have here let's see and then also i found these oven mitts that are so adorable you guys right on set of two oven mitts and let me show you the design so it's santa like he's going down the chimney it says making spirits bright it has santa's um sleigh and then it has like a little village i think it's supposed to be i don't think it's a gingerbread house it's supposed to be like a village and these are so adorable i got them at final clearance because that's when the yellow tag comes in is when they're like almost final clearance three dollars three dollars for a set of ray dunn oven mitts brand new and they are so adorable perfect for next year for christmas to decorate for the kitchen and let's see i think i had a lot more stuff in here than i thought i was going to have i do have a small haul for hobby lobby but i will be sharing that in another video because i don't want the video to be too long so i do have some valentine's day goodies that i want to share with you guys and then I have this tin from Goodwill, you guys. This is so cute. This screams vintage galore. It's a Hershey's Milk Chocolate Kisses tin. And it says a kiss for you. And it's giving me that vintage vibe. It's just amazing. In the back, it tells you the story. Um, in 1907, um, I think it's talking about the history of the Hershey's Chocolate Company. And then in the top, it says a kiss for you with all the chocolate kisses. The tin itself is not vintage, just the design of it on the outside. And it was $1.99 at Goodwill. And I figured this is absolutely perfect. It doesn't go with Valentine's Day colors, but Hershey's and kisses, I mean, I'm connecting to both. So it's going to work. So this is going to be a decoration for the hutch, which I thought would be really, really cute to have on there. And another sign that I have is more Johanna Parker. I did not have any luck with Johanna Parker mugs for Christmas, but I did find a lot of the salt and pepper shakers. You guys, this is how I found it. I found it like this, all messed up at TJ Maxx. And I got it after Christmas, so it was on sale. I got it only for $4. It's the Mr. and Mrs. Claus salt and pepper shaker in the like mint color green and light almost pink colored um salt and pepper shakers they're absolutely adorable i loved it I, it's gonna be a part of my collection since i didn't have anything else for johanna parker christmas so that was a good find and let's see i also have so i also bought a bunch of hats Ray Dunn also has like a hat collection and I when I saw this I thought it was absolutely perfect I have a few of you a few of them to share with you guys the first one is this one it's so cute it's proud in the LGBTQ colors love it love it love it it's perfect for San Francisco I do love wearing hats a lot and you guys will always notice that I always have a hat on in the video it's because I don't have time to style my hair and that's just too much work I work from home so I don't have to style my hair for any reason and I got this for nine dollars and 99 cents and I thought it was really cute and it's going to be perfect for uh, San Francisco with next week's trip that's coming up and I also got this 2022 Ray Dunn planner. It was $4.50 at TJ Maxx. 
and this is perfect to plan everything out for 2022 which i'm a little bit behind because i do want to organize myself a little bit more my hubby found these and he actually bought them for me he's such a sweetheart he got me this one and it's the let it snow hat by ray dunn this was only i believe six dollars it was missing the tag and this is the other tag was six dollars and fifty cents from Marshalls for this witch please black hat which I absolutely love I can't wait to sport this for Halloween on the back it does say Ray Dunn on all of them I love that it has purple in the back and the lettering is just so cute I love 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 these hats so I have that to sport for the next year for Christmas and Halloween I do have another Goodwill find I actually found this yesterday well actually my husband found it he found it and I just could not give it up. I had to have it. It was $5.99 Ray Dunn Santa's Cookies. This is the cutest canister ever. And it's a two, it says 230 at the bottom of the stamp. $6 again at Goodwill. This is really brand new. There's like nothing wrong with it. It's absolutely gorgeous. I love this typewriter font. It's really, really cute, very simple, very clean. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, I can't believe it. Christmas. So, so excited. Even though Christmas is already over, it's nice that I'm able to still expand my collection. And speaking of Christmas, you guys, this is the last item of the haul. It's the last Christmas item that I found. And I told myself I am done. I'm not buying any more Christmas Ray Dunn related items. But I could not believe the price on these. I was so happy because I really, really wanted these, you guys. I really, really wanted these lack, like Shine Luster mini, mini birdhouses. They're really small. They come in two green and two red. It says Noel, Santa, Xmas, and Mary. They are just so precious and so perfect for the hutch. I can't wait for next year. Well, technically this year. This year, this year. I'm okay, correct. I'm going back because I think I said next year for the hats. This year for this 2022 Christmas and Halloween season, all of this stuff is going to look amazing. So these are so beautiful, you guys, but I just couldn't find it in myself to pay $24.99, which is how much they were originally. I got them for $10. $10 for these. And that's a great price. I was like, you know what? I didn't even question it. $10. For these they used to be $24.99 yes please oh my gosh these are so adorable I really really love these they are so cute and I cannot wait to show them off for Christmas this year okay my lovelies that is the end of today's haul and I have one more haul coming at you which is going to be a Hobby Lobby um, valentine's day slash st patrick's day just a few little goodies that i found that i want to share with you that will go into my hutch for oh excuse me for valentine's day and i can't wait for you guys to see that as well make sure to let me know in the comments below what was your favorite item you guys that you enjoyed from this haul there was a lot a lot of goodies and i'm just so excited that a lot of them were such a great price i just i can't believe it so if you've stuck around this long for the video which i hope you did because i do have a special announcement i am doing a giveaway so i hope that you join in on this giveaway here it goes it's called daniel's holiday clearance giveaway so what does that mean these are items that i was going through to put away in storage and i bought a few extras and i'm just like i don't need them what am i going to do with them i i just don't need them i overbought so i want to show you guys what you will get if you win this giveaway one lucky winner will win all of these items and it will be no shipping at cost for you i will take care of everything i will just require your information so i can ship it out to you and the first item are these target collectible bottles that you guys saw one of them is the reindeer food with the carrots these are santa's cookies and then the snow balls and these are three little bottles which are absolutely adorable they were from target disclaimer there is just a little bit of damage inside of the little package but other than that they're fine these are have never been opened so you would get that 
Another Target item that you're going to get is going to be these little cuties. So you're going to get the Snowballs for 5 cents tin um, pail, Fresh Cut Trees pail, and the Firewood for a dollar pail. Another three pack that's also going to be included in the giveaway prize. And last but not least, I'm also giving away this metallic Ray Dunn cup, insulated cup that says eggnog. And this was originally from Mark and this will also be included in the giveaway so here we go for the rules guys you must of course like this video and in the comments below I want you to put what is something that you look forward to this year in 2022 share with me what is something that you are very very looking forward to is it a new job is it a you know a trip somewhere that you're safely going to travel to is it a new job is it a new adventure is it um a show, a movie, uh, anything. What are you most excited about 2022? Share with that below in the comments below. Again, like this video, share that comment with me and you must be subscribed. So make sure that you are subscribed to my channel and you will be entered into this giveaway. This giveaway is going to be starting today, Friday and will end, let's see, let's give it until next Wednesday. Next Wednesday will be the last day and I do ask for you to give me a few days um, to either announce the winner or to also send out the package because I will be traveling to San Francisco next week. Next Thursday is when we're leaving so that might be a little bit, uh, you know, a lot of things going on before I leave to San Francisco. So I may not get a chance to deliver that item to be shipped out by the post office to the winner until a few days after or for me to announce the winner, but the contest will end, the giveaway will end next Wednesday. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to enter the giveaway if you'd like to enter for a chance to do win these little goodies. All the rules are going to be in the bottom of the description below on the video and good luck to everyone. One winner will win these three goodies. So as always, this is Daniel from Second Chance Love, hoping you guys have a wonderful, wonderful weekend and I am very excited as I head into the happiest place on earth, Disneyland. Oh, you guys have no idea how excited I am and I can't wait to share that with you guys back next week with another video of all my vlogging from Disneyland. So until next time, guys, this is Daniel wishing you a wonderful weekend. Bye.